Yeah, so it's come to my attention that whenever I play any of these Yandere style games, you guys be hooking it up. Every single one of those videos that I've uploaded in like this kind of crazy Yandere style typically performs well, which means you guys clearly like this kind of stuff. So I'm sitting here thinking, how can I possibly go on without playing the original, the game that started it all? I'm actually surprised I had never played this before. Now, what I'm about to say may shock you, but I think I'm actually going to turn this into a playthrough. Yeah, I know, I know. I never do playthroughs like ever, but I don't really want to force all the gameplay into like one singular video. I kind of want to separate and spread it out and make it more a uh, full experience, if you know what I'm saying. But yeah, man, that's enough talking. Let's just get up in this Yandere simulator and see if we can do what we got to do. Okay, so we got 1980s mode over here. I'm not touching that right now. Uh, we're, we're, we're just gonna play as uh, Ayano. Am I getting blackmailed? There's no need to play dumb with me. I'm trying to help you. But I think this person's name is Info-chan, right? The, he was with. the who? Listening. Her name is Osana Nashi. Oh. She has a crush So on she him. is our first target. She's planning to confess to him next Friday. Underneath the chair. I don't know if that's gonna happen. Okay, she's over here playing it out. There's a lot of cinematics in this, man. I know this is very different from the initial, like, first demos that came out. How did she get so many pictures of her? Oh, so there's different methods you can do, or you can just go in and freestyle. I, I'm just gonna go with this one, honestly. I feel like, all this, although this one says uh, it's, like, really high difficulty, I feel like this is probably gonna be, like, the easiest one to pull off. We just gain her trust. It's pretty much gonna fall right into our hands. Okay, so we, we're finally in the school, man. It's been freaking forever. Look at how many different students we got here. Who, who's screaming? Yo, I know you ain't talking to him like that. Hey. Okay. Nah, my bad. Let me catch you talking to him like that again. Let me let me let me catch you. She's busy with an event right now. I don't care. I need to befriend you. Come here. I'm gonna betray you and then stab you in your back. I'm not eavesdropping. I would This is a private conversation. Is it? There's a lot of freaking students here, man. Is this the freaking student body? Die. Do that one more time. Watch what happens. Do that one more time. Die. Oh! Die. 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 Stop! Sorry. Not my fault. She provoked me. She she bumped into me, and she didn't even apologize. All she had to say was, "Nope." You know how disrespectful that is. You could at least said sorry. I I wasn't even gonna really. I wasn't gonna stab you with the scissors. I just pulled them out to make a point. I don't know what that point was, but she didn't have to pepper spray me. Uh, let's 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 just start over. I mean, I kind of mess it up anyways with the whole eavesdropping situation. So first of all, we need to figure out how we even talk to Osana in the first place. Oh, there it is. I should take this call in private. Yeah, you should. Too bad it's not gonna be private at all. I'm gonna follow you. Wait, wait, wait! Don't move too fast because you're you're running kind of fast. Right? Hello. I told you to stop calling me, you creep. Uh huh. How many times do I have to say it? I'm not interested. Hmm. If you don't okay. stop bothering me, I'm gonna call the cops and. What? Why you? Why does this man have your number? Wait. Why don't you block it? What? Are you serious? You see what happened? You should have blocked him. Okay. Okay. Fine. I won't call the police. What did? What did he say? I don't really want to know. It was Look, probably something crazy, this is but. This bad time for me. We'll talk about this later. Just don't do anything rash, okay? Dang. What the freak did he say? Bro's a scumbag. Too bad I don't... Well, I don't really care because I'm going to kill you anyways, but like... Damn, I just realized I'm in a boy's bathroom. You're so annoying. Go away. Why are you everywhere? I yeah, yeah. I'm ready to talk about it when classes are done for the day. Somewhere... Private. <laughs> okay, so... Info we have is she's being blackmailed by some creep, clearly. And, uh... We're... Assuming we're gonna have to help her take care of that issue. They're over here walking inside of each other I mean, I know y'all are close, but like that's a little bit too close. Like maybe if you could just step out 
Now y'all know, put the freaking burners on. You gotta put on the freaking Nikes or something. Go, run faster than this. This is a little weak behind jog. Okay, what y'all talking about? What y'all talking about? really upset. Is something wrong? I, well, yeah. I do have a problem. Mm-hmm, it's getting juicy. It's Not getting juicy. Sure able to help me. Nah, she can't help you, but I can. Please, tell me what's wrong. I'll listen. I'll listen too. A few days ago, and she stood to town. This weird guy approached me and started flirting with me. Okay. And he was really creepy and gross. And okay, but what does he have on you? I don't care about this. It took forever to make him leave me alone. The next day, I started getting text messages from him, even though I never gave him my phone number. Oh yeah, he's a super creep. The worst part is he probably got it from Info China or something. What he's taken of me. It's like he's just following me around and snapping photos all day. Yeah, he's getting that from Info John. You've got a stalker? Oh my god, that's horrible. You need to tell the police before he does something bad. Okay, no, so she I has a stalker. He told me that if I go to the police, he'll... He'll what? He'll... What What will he do? What will he do? I can't even speak English. What do, What does he have on you? I don't want to tell you, but, but calling the police is not an option. What the freak did you do? What is it? I need to know. blackmailing you? Are you hiding some kind of secret? She's gotta be. And you can't even no, tell your friend? Nothing like that. I don't believe you. Osana, I try to avoid talking about this, but I'm actually very strong. If you tell me who is doing this to you, I'll stop them. Yo, what what you about to do? What? She said no, she's gonna handle I it herself. Okay, it whatever. Look, You're not about to do anything. I appreciate your concern, but please, just let me deal with this myself. What was the point of talking about it then? If you say so, but now I'm really worried. Literally, all you did was worry your friend. Now that you mention it, yeah, there is something I need help with. I lost my phone charger. Okay, so I'm so doing a task for a you? I know that I lost it somewhere in the hedge maze. Hedge maze. But I don't want to go back in there. It's scary. I'm worried I'll get lost and be stuck in there for hours. So I gotta go get lost Whatever instead? I'm asking. But would you be willing to go into the hedge maze and get my phone charm for me? Of course, my friend. What wouldn't I do really? for my new You'll best friend Osana? You're a lot more brave than I am. Good luck. Brave? What are you what are you afraid of? Some leaves? What the freak are you talking about? Now where the freak is the hedge maze? I don't even know where that is. Okay, so we're in this freaking hedge maze. And I'm probably gonna get lost. I literally hate mazes probably than anyone on the face of this freaking planet. Don't even at me. I don't care what you're saying. Oh my gosh. Freaking dead end. Oh my god, I knew it. Bro, I'm gonna be in this maze for like three hours. Ooh, I found it. Stupid phone charm. Yo, Sana. Got your thing for you, girl. Oh my gosh! You actually found it! Yeah, that's what I do. That's amazing! Thank uh -huh. you so much! Uh-huh. Where's my reward? Okay, so now we have to go find her locker. Actually, we already know where her locker is, and we just have to leave the note in here. I think we can change this to about her stalker now. There we go. Stalker and blackmail at the bottom here. Please meet me um, at the school rooftop at 4 p.m. We'll finish. There we go. I just left her a note. Uh, yeah. Saw somebody put a note in your logger. What are you talking about? I did everything for you. What the frick is this man doing? Okay, we have two dilemmas here. It says I don't have enough reputation points, but I don't know what the freak to do about that. I've done like everything that I'm allowed to do for her today, so what the heck? All right, so I've pretty much done everything I need to do. I got my rep all the way back up. Um, I just put the note in the locker, and now I have to see if she'll actually listen to me when I tell her to go to the freaking locker. Thank you, geez, that took forever. All right, so I finally convinced her to do it. Yeah, go ahead, Osana. Go ahead. Go ahead and read the note. Nothing suspicious. Oh, get the freak out of here, you freaking weirdo. I don't like her. Hey, keep walking. What you got to say about the note, Osana? Maybe huh? I should meet them. Maybe you should. Okay, so looks like we've arranged our little meeting here. Now we just got to wait for the time. I really don't want to run past this weirdo. Can I? You know, fine, I'll walk. My bad. Huh? You're the one who wanted to meet me? Yeah, it was me. It's me all along. Your note said that you wanted to talk about blackmail? Yeah, you know what's going on. Don't play stupid yes. now. 
I know that you have a stalker. Is she talking? And I know that he's blackmailing It's me. the first time I've heard her speak. At least, like, in-game. No, you've got the wrong idea. Oh, yeah? I mean, yeah, someone is stalking me, but uh -huh. he's not blackmailing me. I don't believe you. Then, why don't you call the police? Her he's, voice is so menacing. He's got a... He's got a hostage. He's threatening to harm them what if the I What the heck? Box. He got a hostage? What? Who is being held hostage? She acts like she cares. I know you're not going to be able to take me seriously after you hear this. It's my cat. My pet cat. He kidnapped her, and he said he's going to kill her if I call the police. How did I know it was going to be a cat? I just want this horrible experience to end, one way or another. You got my number? I'll text you his address. I never gave you my number. Thank you. But don't blame me if you get hurt. And don't let anything happen to my cat. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I know what I'm doing. Don't worry. Leave it to me. Okay, what kind of sodas we got? We got... Pretzi? <laughs> Cola Dora? <laughs> Mr. Peter? What is that? <laughs> I don't know about that, Mr. Peter. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. I don't, I don't know nothing about that one. Can I go at nighttime? Oh, I can go to his house now. Okay. I thought it was gonna make me wait till the morning. I guess we're going in PJ. No, we're not going in PJ. She's going. She's definitely putting on some clothes. It'd be funny if she popped out in it with the slippers on and everything. Okay. There's a moon. Oh, all right. Oh, she she suited up. Oh yeah. It's time to handle some business. Let's do this. Okay, we're on a stealth type mission. Okay. Sneak inside the house. There are multiple ways inside. Yo, this is freaking heat. Are you kidding me? What we got here? Is this a breaker box? Sabotager. What happens? I'll cut the power off. Is he going to step out or something? Oh, jeez. Oh, he coming. He coming. He coming. He coming. He coming. He coming. Oh, here's another way in. Let's see if we could just climb in. Yo, why are you climbing so slow? Yeah, there you go. Get to it. Yo, this is reminding me of a uh, thief simulator. Okay, okay. All right, so so we're in. That was freaking easy. All right, find the stalker's room on the first floor of the house. Where's he at, though? Your brother's bed. You have no idea. Who is that? Let me tell you about the creep I have to live with. Most of the time, am I gonna need this information? I, I don't want to walk away. This. I feel like I'm gonna need this. It's not hard since he never wants to interact with anyone. Dude, moral of the story: her brother's a bum who has no life. That's pretty much what she just said. His room is right underneath mine, and sometimes I hear him watching hentai and playing porn games. Okay, just say he's a degenerate I'm already. One day he's gonna creep into my room, and ugh. Let's just say that I always keep my door locked when I- Why are you thinking stuff like that? Can I use that information or something? Because it didn't even say I got any information for that. That freaking music sting just now just actually scared me. I really feel like I'm playing Thief Simulator right now. What the frick is he doing? Why are there like little pouches all over the, the floor too? Just need to pass him on the couch. Can you see me from here? Definitely can't. Where's his room at? It's gotta be over here or something, right? Now, where did I put that cake mix? That's his mom right there. Hmm, she kinda, she, she kinda thick fun. though. I hope the dad ain't home. Wait, was that the dad? I just thought about that. That must be the dad messing with the TV. This is this man's room. Yo, this door needs some WD-40. My love, my queen. My what the goodness. heck, you weirdo. Oh my gosh, bro, so strange. You existed somewhere in the real world. Huh? Hey, you? how's it How going, bro? In here? Are you one of my sister's friends? No. What no. do you want? I don't know what you're talking about. You won't get away with this. Hey, yo, 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 yo. Get the freak back, bro. Yeah. Get back, bro. Lay down. Go to sleep. Night, night. I bet bro dreaming about hentai and porn games, just like just like his sister said. <laughs> Listen, I don't care about your family drama. I'm leaving. My, my my task here is done. All right. Let's go ahead and get the freak up out of here. Yo, get some WD-40 while y'all at it, bro. Get some WD-40. That's what y'all need to invest in. Talking about some freaking putting food on the table and stuff. You need to put some WD-40 on the table. Okay, we. I, I got your cat. Oh my god! That's my cat! That is your cat indeed. You're welcome. 
That's what I do. I need to return oh, crap. I didn't mean to skip that part. And I need to have an important discussion with you. But it's too late at night right now. Please meet me at my house before school tomorrow. Okay. I will. And one last time. Thank you. You're welcome. As long as you come meet me. You have a nice place, Yanchan. Oh, I got it. I got it. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. Where are your parents? Overseas. Uh huh. So you take care of yourself? That must be hard. Parents are overseas like that? I manage. What do your parents do? They probably make money if they're overseas. And saving me from that stalker. You're welcome. That was a horrible experience. I'm so glad it's all over. So what are my options here? Can I still kill? <sighs> why? Why do I want to kill her the so badly? Ready. Maybe I shouldn't I'll kill her. I'll be right back. Feel free to keep talking. I can't imagine what it's like to become obsessed with someone after meeting them for the first time. What? It doesn't make any sense. What you trying to say? I'm shocked that there are people in this world who would actually be willing to harm a cat just to get what they want. That's insane. He what? said he loved me, but I don't think it was love. It was just a sick, twisted obsession that he believed. I don't know what to love. pick. I'm trying to decide of what sick. she's talking about right now. But starting today, I won't have to worry about it anymore. Did I take too long? All thanks to you. Here's your tea. Did I give Thank her normal you? tea? Oh, I just realized I've been rambling this entire time. Because I didn't touch you it. You said you had something important to tell me, right? Yes. I could have I could have just literally murdered her just now. Too. I didn't want to do her like that though. The boy you have a crush on. Let's see if she just leaves him oh, alone. I don't have a crush on him. Why are you lying? He's just my childhood friend, that's all. Don't lie. I don't have feelings for him at all. I'm not stupid. If that's true, then you wouldn't mind if I confessed my love to him. Would you? Huh? Confess your... Love? That's what she said. Are you you have a problem that with that? You have feelings for him? Yes. Deep feelings. And, and I just I've did you a huge favor, though. About You're lucky before. I didn't kill you just now. I could have poisoned you. And I can't bear <laughs> the thought of seeing him with anyone else. Yeah. I know that what she you said. love him. And I know that this is a selfish request. But, please, don't take him away from me. What if she's just like, nah. Let me try nah, to forget that. He's mine. Heart. Long pause. Really? It's true. It was that easy? I do have feelings for him. But. But. After everything you've done for me. I really didn't do all that much. I did like one thing. Actually, two things. So, so what are we friends now, too? And, you, and okay. you're going back off? I'll do as you've asked. Stay away from him. Thank you. Good looks. But you'd better take really good care of him, okay? Uh, Don't worry. I, I can't will. say that she will. I'm not entirely positive you will. Like, what would happen if he were to, like, uh, decide he wanted to go talk to someone else, for instance? Probably wouldn't end too well for any of the parties involved. Oh, I got the befriend ending. Yeah, I could have betrayed her just then, but... I don't know, man. I, I was I was like waiting to see like if she would start talking crazy, cause I felt like it was reflecting Ayano and what she like what she was talking about, how she like instantly fell in love with him. It was kind of the same situation that her stalker had going on with, um, her. You know, I think the whole point of that whole conversation was to bait me into kind of picking her off if I felt like it based off of what her philosophy was. But I don't know, man. It wasn't really enough to sway me. I don't know, man. I'm satisfied with this. All right, that was a lot of freaking work. That took me about two and a half hours to do because I didn't know what I was doing. I went through the tutorial, did a lot of freaking stuff. But I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this first part of Beyond Race Simulator here. Obviously, we're gonna go through and probably take out the rest of the rivals or at least everything else that's including the game. I'm looking forward to 1980s mode. I'm looking forward to just messing around with some of the other things in the game, like the, the like the cheat codes and stuff like that. That's all gonna be fun. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave me any comments and suggestions of any of the games you think I should play. Don't forget to strike that like button, subscribe to the Stormkin. I am Zithanus, so I am out. See you guys in the next video.